Hi and welcome to Mulch Studios. For those of you who are new, I'm Atul and in this tutorial we'll be going over how to create your seasonal settings for your tree. This is a continuation from our previous tutorial, the oak tree. You can check the link up above here. And um, feel free to support us on our Patreon page. It will help us grow this channel and bring you content weekly. So without any further ado, let's dive in. So here in Spooch, you can see um, I went ahead and created some spring leaves, summer leaves and autumn leaves. Um, and it's basically easy. I just took the original and just played with the saturation and contrast values as well for the for the summer leaves. I did the same, just made them less bright and the autumn leaves. I just went in and added some red and green. Same for the last one, added more red, less green and so on. So for this to work, we need to create our material sets to assign them to the seasons. So let's go over to the material sets and let's add our material sets here quickly. So the first one, let's rename this to uh, spring, right? And let's add another one and let's rename this to summer. And let's add another one and let's rename this to autumn. Okay. So our material sets are created. So now let's add our leaves to this members group here. So let's add a few here. One, two, three, because we have three spring leaves. The more, the better, and so on. So for the sake of this tutorial, I just created three, two, and two. So let's add spring leaf one, spring leaf two, and spring leaf three. So don't worry about these seasonal settings here. Uh, we'll override them here. So let's select them and let's assign them to spring. All right, so now let's submit over to summer and let's add our summer leaves here. Let's add them. Summer leaf one and summer leaf two. And again, the same process, select override and let's set this to summer. Okay, so now let's head over to the autumn one. Let's override this. Let's add it to autumn and add members let's add two autumn leaf and autumn leaf two okay so you guys can go in even further and create the in between leaves the transition to autumn and dead leaves and so on so you can go crazy with this so let's head over to materials tab here quickly and let's head over to the batch leaves here so let's assign these material sets to our batch leaves now to do this, let's get over to the skin tab. Normally, this would be how it looks, nothing. So let's add a few. One, two, three, because we have three material sets. Let's add spring, summer, and autumn. So let me just quickly delete the seasonal light here quickly. And before we get into this, let's head over, let's zoom in here quickly. Let's select our first set of branches. Because we want to tell Speechy that we want a gradient from the top down. So let's select the big branches, head over to the material, and where it says season, the descent offset. Let's set this to 0.15 and amend the blue, the green curve. Normally it's like this, so there's no gradient happening. So let's take this down so the gradient starts from the top down. So as if I zoom out now, and let's just increase this value some more, we'll see the gradient happening from top to bottom. All right, so let's take this back to 1.5 to one. Okay, so now we have our seasons set up. So we have summer, autumn, and winter, no leaves. So if we go in between summer and autumn, there's something strange happening. We are losing our leaves. And if you go over to autumn, they're reappearing again, and that's not right. So let's get over and select summer, in between summer and autumn. Let's go over to the material set and select summer. So all we need to do is take this point, just move it a little bit to the right and go to the autumn one and just move this a little bit to the right as well. Something like that. All right, so now if we move it now to autumn, full autumn leaves, same here and summer here. If you want the autumn leaves to bleed more into the summer, let's just select the autumn one here and just move this to the left again somewhere about there so now we have these little patches of autumn leaves coming through so now let's add our seasonal light to this tree so we can manipulate where we want this effect to start happening so let's select the batch leaves right click add force and let's scroll down where we see seasonal light 
So if, if right away it started working because we have more autumn leaves at the top, less at the bottom. So now if we go over to the batch leaves here and in the forces tab, if we increase this to one, you'll start seeing we're losing some leaves here at the top. If we put it to three and so on. So let's set this to 0.35 and let's take the slider to about between summer and spring. So now if we go here and we increase this value to 0.45 to 3, we'll start happening and you'll start creating this effect. So that is it for this tutorial. I hope you guys find this tutorial informative. If you did, hit that like and subscribe button down below to keep you informed for new content coming soon. And uh, stay safe, take care, and I'll see you in the next one.